let's look at adding routes to your server let me open up my console and if you had already seen my repl video you know what i'm doing here i'm just testing my snippets of codes before i implement it into my app actual application here i'm requiring the url module of node.js and storing it in an, in an object called url and also assigning a domain name with a port number and a path name path name is about here to another variable called my url using url object i'll just pass my url so i'm interested in parsing the url so i'll make use of the function parse so we have different resources available here with the parse method i'll pass in my parse variable and access the host name which is technotip.org and i'll now access the port name port number which is 3030 next the path which is about so just check my url the entire url the domain name the port number and the path so let's get started with the actual application here adding routes to your server we require url module and http module http module to create the server as we already know the create server method of http object passes in two objects to the anonymous function which is request and response inside this server i am taking a variable called my path and assigning the user request url that is which is present in request.url and its path name we are only interested in the path name and not the domain name and its port so we parse it using url object and with the help of parse method of url object if the path name is just a forward slash which means it's an home page technically using res that is response object i'll call right head and pass 200 which means okay and the content type information to the header of the client which is browser plain text and i'll call the end method of response object by outputting a string to the onto the web page which is home page if it's a forward slash then it's a home page else if if the path is slash about the user is requesting service using the url some url colon port number slash about which is slash about is the path which will be fetched by url parser if that is the path name will display about us next similarly the contact route if that is the case if that is the route path then will display contact us at last well we, let me show you redirection too which we had already covered in our previous tutorial i'll include that too here if he types path name as my name that is satish i'll just redirect with 301 redirection and specify the location to be redirect that is home page a forward slash so the text remains the same that is home page so after all these condition else whatever other paths are show 404 that is page not found error message on the browser well this is our routing information for the server at the end bind the listen method at port number 3030 or else people asked me why 3030 so i am taking 8080 here you could take any port number because this is your server that you are creating using node.js so the local host ip address is 127.0.0.1 so the console log server started 
well people do this mistake often they directly go to this ip address with this port number and think why the hell is the server not responding the simple reason is because you haven't started the server at go to the console window navigate to your folder and execute this file first so we have an error here that is the c that is console in the line number 34 so let me make it smaller case we need to execute it again so the server started now go to this address oops well look at this the execution the server terminated by itself error is present in line number eight which is here i have just misspelled it make it smaller case so execute again server is running go here okay it's working home page and the server is running too now go to slash about so the about us now contact uh, oops this should have redirected to home page i have a mistake here we need to restart the server whenever there is a changes to our javascript file now let me come if something irrelevant it will go to 404 error so this is how routing can be applied implemented to your server so please share this video with your friends well this is the basic routing methodology just by using http and the url modules going forward we will use web frame frameworks like express well express is a web framework for node.js we'll be covering it in upcoming video tutorials stay tuned for now share this video with your friends on facebook google plus linkedin twitter stumble upon etc stay subscribed to technotip.com technotip.org and to our youtube channel and don't forget to like this video on youtube